The next area we're going to discuss is what's called M1, or the primary motor cortex. It's very easily located by taking half the distance of nasian to inian, and essentially just a little bit in front of that, because CZ is usually the central sulcus, and so right in front of that is the motor cortex, or the primary motor cortex. Now, this anatomy of the motor cortex um, is that the feet and legs are at the top, and then the arms, and then the hands, and the fingers, and the thumb, and down here the face and the mouth. So when stimulating the hand area, one stimulates here. The leg area is up here. M1 is important because most of the neurological studies stimulating the brain with TMS, especially with Parkinson's disease, have been at M1. So when lining up to M1, you have several different options, depending on how medial or lateral you are. And the more lateral, you want to take more of a 45 degree angle. And usually for stroke, the stimulation is contralateral.